In this short video here, I'm going to show you how to check clutch offset on an Articat F-Series snowmobile. And it's going to be pretty much similar to other Articats, but um, the specs might be slightly different. Um, what you're going to need is a clutch tool. Um, this is 92 to 2006 Articat chain case, which is not the right one. We're going to use this one. It's 2007 plus diamond drive. And basically, you're going to take the tool, line it up again along the face of the clutch. Make sure you're not on any bolts, whatever. And then you're going to set it down. And we need to measure the clearance on the inside of that inside sheave there. So. I'm going to grab some feeler gauges and we'll check that out. So I got my feeler gauges. Um, the spec for this measurement is less than 1.5 millimeter space behind the clutch alignment tool and between the clutch alignment tool and the sheath. So if you are touching the sheave, and you're not supposed to be touching the back sheave with the clutch alignment tool, um, and the space between the, the tool and the sheave has to be less than 1.5 millimeters. So I've got a one millimeter here, and that doesn't fit there. So I know we're within spec. I'm not touching the sheave. I'm less than 1.5 millimeters, so we're good less than one millimeter so we're good and that's basically it so on this slide diamond drive model the secondary clutch sits on this shaft and to say um, if our offset was off we would correct that by the washers behind the secondary on the diamond drive shaft here so it's pretty straightforward Adding washers will bring the clutch out and taking washers away will move the clutch in. And after you do that, you, re you recheck with your clutch alignment tool and verify that you're good to go. So the clutch offset should be checked if you got the clutch off. Um, you made changes to your clutch or, or uh, maybe you had the motor out. Um, you have the diamond drive out, stuff like that. Basically, if you had either clutch off, you should recheck it when you're reinstalling.